Welcome back to another content here on the Famous in America channel. January was a cruel month all over the world and the losses were overwhelming, do you agree? A lot is happening and we are all losing relatives and friends and it's no different with celebrities. In this video, we'll bring you the most unexpected deaths of the month of January 2023. Remembering that the selection is made right here in the channel's newsroom and the votes are just among us, okay? But before we continue, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave your like and comment. Help us grow and buy food for our mascot, Sunny Retriever. Let's get to the content. We start our list with none other than Fred White. Music already starts the year 2023, losing one of its biggest icons. White, American Hall of Fame drummer, one of the first musicians from the fantastic soul and disco music band, Earth, Wind and Fire, died at the age of 67 on January 1, 2023, from undisclosed causes. Gangsta Boo, one of the pioneers of female rap, died at the age of 45 also from undisclosed causes. She was a member of the 3-6 Mafia group. The group won an Oscar for Best Song in 2006, with the famous song, It's Hard Out Here for a Pimp. The eternal businessman and pilot Robbie Pierce lost his life at the age of 63, while diving on the island of Bonaire, in the Caribbean. The owner of the famed off-road racing vehicle builder Jimco, Pierce will always be remembered as the business mind behind the growth and development of brands like Mastercraft and Impact Safety, companies that elevated the safety of drivers and teams all over the world. Tell me if this isn't an unexpected death. Mike Hill American editor and producer, best known for his work on Rush, On the Edge of Emotion, 2013, Frost slash Nixon, 2008, and Apollo 13, From Disaster to Triumph, 1995, died of pneumonia at the age of 73, on January 5, 2023 in Omaha, Nebraska, USA. American actress Annette McCarthy, who played Evelyn Marsh in the acclaimed series Twin Peaks, 1990-1991, died on January 8, 2023, at the age of 64. The cause of death, however, has not yet been disclosed. <laughs> American driver Ken Block, who became a YouTube star thanks to his series of videos Gymkhana, in which he performed acrobatics, pirouettes, and maneuvers with various types of vehicles, died at the age of 55 in a snowmobile accident. He was descending a steep slope when the vehicle overturned and fell on him, according to authorities in Wasatch County, Utah, USA. This was unanimous here in the newsroom, perhaps the most unexpected death in recent months. Ken will leave many missed, as he was a distinctive presence wherever he went. I'm a model. I've worked in the fashion business for a long time. I was born in Hamburg, Germany, and I grew up in Sweden. German model Tatjana Paditz, one of the supermodels of the 90s, died at the age of 56 after a battle against breast cancer. Times. That's where the relationship comes in, like how long have you known a photographer, certain photographers make you feel comfortable, where you don't feel, you know, like it's a big deal. Tatiana became more famous after participating in the Freedom video by the also deceased singer George Michael. Jeff Beck, an English guitarist, died from a bacterial infection caused by meningitis in a hospital near Riverhall on January 10, 2023, at the age of 78. The world of music has lost one of its greatest guitarists and we will certainly never have someone at his level again. Beck played in the famous band Yardbirds, replacing another music icon named Eric Clapton. This death left us at the channel sad for several days.
The singer C.J. Harris, who participated in American Idol and reached the top six in 2014, died on January 15, 2023 at the age of 31. After suffering a heart attack in Jasper, Alabama, he was taken to a local hospital by ambulance but did not survive. Harris stood out in the competition that had judges, Keith Urban, Jennifer Lopez, and Harry Connick Jr. His version of the Allman Brothers hit, Soulshine, which he dedicated to his father, earned him three votes. Harris was brilliant and his career was certainly cut short. Robin Peter Kendall Bachman, a Canadian drummer and younger brother of guitarist, singer, and songwriter Randy Bachman, died on January 12, 2023 at the age of 69. He was the original drummer for the Brave Belt and Bachman Turner Overdrive bands. More commonly known as Robbie Bachman. January really took fantastic musicians and Robbie was no exception, one of the best rock drummers. God certainly wanted to assemble a band and took Jeff Beck and then our esteemed Robbie. The cause of death was not disclosed. One of the founders of Screaming Trees Van Conner, bassist of the renowned grunge and alternative rock band with Mark Lanigan as lead vocalist, died on January 17, 2023 at the age of 55. The cause of death was pneumonia, but Connor suffered from a prolonged illness according to his brother, guitarist Gary Lee Connor of the band. I don't know if you knew, but in 2022 the band lost its lead vocalist Mark Lanigan, whose cause of death has not been disclosed to this day. And finally, in my opinion, the most unexpected death of January was that of actress Annie Wershing, 45 years old, victim of an undisclosed cancer on January 29th. Charismatic, beautiful and versatile actress, Annie participated in several series, including 24, Vampire Diaries, The Rookie, Star Trek, Picard and many others. Looks like someone's having fun. I had to feed. She was the series lost one of its most beautiful and likable faces, don't you think? And what did you think of our list? Did you miss someone? Don't agree with our selection? Leave us a comment so we know, okay? Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. God bless everyone, have an excellent February month.